What's good, y'all? I'm Anthony, aka your boy Ant. You know, ever since I heard of cricket, you cricket for the first time ever, I was like, so this must be kind of like baseball. And then when I said that, y'all was like, no, fool, it ain't nothing like baseball. So, um, I thought this was a pretty interesting video, you guys. It's a sports science, cricket versus baseball. I guess we want to figure out some scientific differences between cricket and baseball. So, uh, hey, hit that subscription or hit that subscribe button. Join the team right here. If you like my channel, if you like what you see, I welcome you, man. Um, and let's check this out right now. Link for the original video will be in the description box below. Let's do it. The most obvious similarity between cricket and its cousin baseball cousin. is the duel between bowler and batsman. Here's an ESPN Sports Science breakdown of the showdown. Please show me. This is interesting, guys. Really interesting. Fast bowlers can deliver balls at over 90 miles per hour. But since they're not allowed to bend their elbows, they catapult their torsos forward like javelin elbow? throwers at angular speeds wow. that can exceed 1,000 degrees per second. That's a motion twice as fast as a typical MLB pitcher. Wow. But spin bowlers, like their baseball counterparts, sacrifice speed to induce additional spin. For example, if enough top spin is generated, a bold cricket ball can sink more than 30% faster than gravity alone will make it fall. Wow. <laughs> and to make batting even more challenging, cricket bowlers bounce the ball on the way to the batsman. I've noticed that. This can reduce the ball's speed by more than 40%. So to track and time a bounce, the batsman will shift his gaze away from the ball to where he predicts it'll bounce just 200 milliseconds after the bowler's release. That's less time than a baseball player has to initiate a swing on a 95 mile per hour fastball. To see how a major league baseball player handles cricket bowling, we enlisted the Kansas City Royals, oh, this is cool. Lorenzo Cain. Ah, this is cool as crap. Even though he batted over 300 in the 2014 regular season, cricket's unfamiliar trajectories had Cain hey, baffled. Our analysis shows that switching from baseball to cricket can decrease swing speed by about 7%. But Kane adjusts and finally makes good contact. Black. There we go. Oh! Nice. But he's a professional, so. It was definitely tougher than I thought. Definitely my hat's off to those guys, you know, cricket players. It's definitely a tough sport. That's what's up. The batsmen in cricket do have at least one advantage over baseball players. Because the cricket bat is flat, its sweet spot is big about 32 square inches. That's nearly 800% larger than the sweet spot oh, on a baseball bat. Wow. For ESPN Sports Science, I'm John Brinkus. Good job, John. You know, I wonder if John actually knows, like, is he, is he just a host of this or does he actually know stuff? Like, is he really, is he like, is he, Come on now, what does he know? Like that's some gangster stuff. But uh, this was cool, man. Cool to see. Cool to see the differences. Um, cool to see actual baseball player uh, swing with a quick uh, cricket bat. Uh, that was pretty interesting to see. And the fact that he actually was able to adjust and hit. He is a professional. He's like a pro baseball player, so I'm sure it was a lot easier for him to adjust and hit in the cricket uh, than a regular person. But interesting, man. It seems like basically what I learned from this is that cricket is just a, a seemingly a lot more difficult sport. You know, it's it's a lot more difficult to to bowl or throw the ball than it is a regular baseball because you can't bend your elbow, which is really crazy. It's it's harder to hit the actual ball once it's bowled, is because in baseball it's just coming right at you, bop. And but in in uh, cricket it has to bounce first, which once it bounces it can completely change the trajectory of the ball and how it's twisted and formed. So then you have to adjust all that stuff right there, man. Uh, so yeah, pretty cool stuff, man. You know, love to both, man. You know, just because one may be more difficult ways than the other doesn't mean one is better than the other, man. If you love baseball, play some baseball. If you love cricket, play some cricket. If you love basketball like me, play some basketball. 
I'm out of here, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to hit that description box below for a link for this video. Hit the comment section. Let me know some of you react to next. Hit that subscribe button if you want me. If you want to subscribe.